And it goes towards Mitrovic. Shot of Edels only as far as Sissoko. Back in. This is Vaimar World. Newcastle have got it. Jorginho Vijnaldum pounces and the crowd have been rewarded with a first goal it's their top scorer he scored all of his goals here and he's into double figures and Newcastle have their noses in front this is not on the Spurs plan and you've got to say they deserved it from the first whistle they've been up for it and it's beautifully made this goal they move it quickly across the line ball's put in well and that's a poor header Head back where it's come from. Don't you don't know what's behind you. So the, take nothing away from the finish. The layoffs could look, look at this for a header. Head it. Why is he heading it backwards? You don't know who's behind you there. Just head it the way it's come from. And that's cost them Tottenham. It's a good finish. It's an accomplished finish because it's a difficult one. He's at full stretch. Finishes it beautifully. Look at that. The defender turns his back as well, which is not particularly good. Newcastle all seem to have an outlet at the moment. Van Adam on the left and Sissoko overlapping on the right hand side. Mitrovic joining the fun in the box. This is Mitrovic! Oh, it's a wonderful goal! How about that? Newcastle 2, Spurs nil, and his second place slipping out of sight for Tottenham Hotspur. You want to say a better header than that? That is clinical. And I'll tell you what, Tottenham deserve everything they've got in this first half so far. They've got nothing. They don't, they don't deserve anything for me. It's been unprofessional. They've not wanted it as much as Newcastle United. Look at that. Just so easy for Townsend to run. Nobody tries to stop the cross. Nobody picks him up. Fantastic header. Well, I'll tell you what, how Spurs have gotten second place. Probably the first half performance like this, I'll never know. He wanted that. Defender didn't. The ball's a cracker, but you watch the desire to get this and look at the defender's attempt or lack of it to stop it right there he comes nobody's picking him up he wants that what a tremendous header that is by Mitrovic that's how you head a football in the penalty box maybe Benitez thinks a little bit of stability in there a bit of experience just to calm things down a little bit I suppose just get themselves into the game Tiotes been robbed and this is Harry Kane options right and left for Harry Kane Ericsson and Dyer and this is Lamella with people to aim for and Eric Lamella has squeezed it in that is a fine strike Diallo beaten at the near post and Spurs have hope once more oh, we talked about the first half Harry covered that near post and made that decent save this time Brute strength beats him. Kane does initially well. Plays it off beautifully. You think that may have overplayed it again. He just smashes it as hard as he can, doesn't he? Should he have done better here, Darlow? There's the ball played in. You think he's going to cross it across the face of the goal? Goes near post, and you've got to say a keeper has to protect that near post a little bit better. He smashes it, but no. Didn't stand big, did he? This Oaken might go on his one penalty what a run from Musa Sissoko Anthony Taylor is not going to change his mind remarkable well I'll tell you what that is brilliant design he could have gone down initially before this before he gets in the box well, I'm not so sure there was contact there you know the leg came out but did he touch him here no, he didn't. That's not a penalty. Not a penalty. Never. He's gone down. But the referee's position there. I don't think he could be convinced there. Well, I think the bit a bit unfortunate there. Spurs. So, can Newcastle restore their two-goal cushion? and seriously dense first hopes of finishing second again it's Wijnaldum it's three Newcastle are going out with a bang and Spurs are in real danger of dropping from their lofty position second is starting to look a long way away he was looking to look very close a moment ago the great penalty 
Sends Larice the wrong way. Good power, good direction. All of a sudden, down to 10 men, 2 1. Thinking, well, it's not going to be our day now. All of a sudden, you get the decision that probably you're a bit fortunate to get. I don't understand why the referee gave it. The foot did come out, but pulled it away. There's a word that will be floating around this stadium for next season optimism. That's what we've seen here. Oh, what an effort! Townsend, it was almost subbed a moment ago. He's hit the woodwork, and now he might have another go. Owens oh, has got it. Spurs have been completely destroyed by Newcastle. Rolando Owens, in what could be his last game for the club. Has signed off with a goal. It really could have been even more embarrassing for Spurs. Newcastle are going down fighting. This is incredible, it really is. You have to ask question marks about Tottenham Hotspur this afternoon here. First half performance, abject. Manager realised it was abject, changed it. You saw the ball come off the woodwork there. Everybody stopped. Everybody stopped. But that man who puts it in the net. What a finish that is. This is tremendous by Townsend. So unlucky to see him come off. He turns away. Tottenham players decide to turn away. The next minute, it's in the back of their net. It's totally unprofessional yet again from them. Brilliant finish. Unstoppable there. But the defending or lack of it, just so evident there. It's not over yet. There might be more, they're attacking, it's three on two here. Yamba's going down the right-hand side. Daryl Yamba! Oh, my word! Newcastle have got five! St James's Park hasn't been this loud all season. Spurs are being taken apart. Well, I'll tell you what. I just can't believe what I'm saying out there. I'm so impressed with the way Newcastle have reacted. He's going down to 10 men, deservedly going down to 10 men. They've not dropped their heads, the belief out there is absolutely super. Look at the desire to win that. The ball wasn't a good one, but the desire to win it, and then to do what they do. Look at Yamba getting forward, brings his knee to get in there. I think the is positioned awful, by the way, at that near post. Look at the desire to get in there, but look at Larice's position. He's got to be a little bit further across than that. But again, it's a comfortable finish. But again, I have to say, Tottenham Hotspur, how are they second in the league? They might not be now. Because this has been an absolute shocker. How can he leave after this?